Hey students, next system we're looking at is the integumentary system. And while we look at this, we're going to look, start off by looking at the skin and look at the different regions of the skin. You're going to look at the, the epidermis, the upper layer, um, the avascular layer that's highly keratinized. That's the first. And then we'll go deeper and look at the uh, dermis and study different components within the dermis. Um, one thing along the way, we'll look at his skin color. Okay, look at the different um, types of things that influence this color, such as melanocytes. Um, and then we're going to look at different kinds of appendages of the skin. That will be a next step. And that's going to include the different kinds of glands we have, like the sweat glands, also called sudoriferous glands. Okay, you look at those. And they can be broken down into the eccrine and the apocrine. And you'll take a look at both of those. Those are very interesting um, different types of glands that we have. Okay, and then moving on, we got sebaceous glands, the oil glands, you know, the ones that make you have lots of oil that the bacteria will eat to, to grow uh, acne, you know, and um, move on, look at hair follicles and hair, look how it grows, what controls that growth and the role of nutrition in it. Look at nails, very important aspect to be able to get around, you have your fingernails. I know ladies, you guys spend a lot of time on this, and maybe some of you gentlemen do too. But um, um, these nails are very, very important, and we can tell a lot about someone by looking at their nails uh, in terms of their health. Okay. Um, one thing we'll also do as we go through, as we work, uh, work to the end, is we'll look at the uh, functions of the integumentary system. Make sure you know these functions. It's going to be important for you studying for your test. Now. Um, one thing about skin is there are some, some very distinctive homeostatic imbalances, and particularly you nursing people are going to be um, involved with this later. You know, particularly one which is skin cancer. There's various kinds of skin cancer. Some that relate to the, the melanoma it's, are just devastating for health. There's very little we can do about that at this point in time. But we've got, we got the skin cancer, and we also have burns, which are also devastating. Um, and you'll learn a lot about that, how we determine the extent of burn on the body and um, chances for survival based on that. And um, finally, you'll, you'll look a little bit on the development of it. Okay, well anyway, I hope you have fun studying the um, integumentary system. Bye.